So this is a uh, pre-calc topic five, and this is uh, one of the solutions from the uh, assignment A6, the practice. So we are supposed to rewrite this as a single cosine statement. And um, I notice this is a linear combination. I'm adding them together. They have the same periods. So uh, looking back at old Keith here, that's my relationship right there. And then all I have to do is think about what my capital A is and what my D is. So in order to do this type of problem, I'm going to start by drawing a triangle. And I know that cosine is about x, so uh, I'm going to have it go 15 in this direction. Uh, sine is about y, so I'm going to have it go 8 in that direction. So I have some angle in here. This angle is the, uh, the, the shift in the linear transformation, and then this distance right here is a so I can figure this out by first off doing some Pythagorean theorem I know that 15 squared plus 8 squared equals a squared. So a is going to be the square root of 15 squared plus 8 squared so that's uh, 225 plus 64 square root of 289 I get 17 so, so far, I know that it's going to be 17 times the cosine of something minus some shift. And that shift, again, is this angle D. And I can get at that uh, by using tangent. I know that tangent of D is 8 fifteenths, opposite over hypotenuse, whatever X. So that means that D must be inverse tangent of 8 fifteenths. My calculator is in degrees right now. Um, and it didn't specify degrees, it didn't specify degrees or radians. So I'll just do it in degrees. I'll write both answers on. I get about uh, 28.07 degrees. So that's this angle right here. And uh, if I had written this in radians, that would have been uh, 0.490 about radians. And 